Our part-time Masters in Advanced Clinical Practice programme has a diverse range of modules tailored to support the career development of non-consultant hospital doctors in Ireland. We have three mandatory or core modules and a choice from eight optional modules. An MSc award requires completion of 90 ECTs. Scholars must complete three mandatory modules, totaling 55 ECTs, and then select four optional modules from a range of eight, totaling 35 ECTs. These will consist of three 10 credit modules and one five credit module. I'd like to firstly introduce you to our mandatory or core modules in our Masters in Advanced Clinical Practice programme. Scholars that have been working outside or are new to the academic environment will update or gain research skills according to contemporary standards as preparation to undertake original research. This module will equip scholars with the tools to prepare, manage and design a substantial research project. This module aims to provide surgeons in training with an opportunity to gain a deeper and more systematic understanding of ethical and legal issues, both in principle and in practical aspects of healthcare and clinical research. In order to successfully achieve the qualification of an MSc in advanced clinical practice, scholars must complete a substantial research dissertation in a speciality of their choice. The dissertation must be original scholastic work. Scholars will consult with supervisors at regular intervals throughout the research process and will have at least six months to complete the dissertation. I would now like to introduce you to our eight optional modules associated with our Masters in Advanced Clinical Practice. The aim of this module is to provide scholars with hands-on experience in the industry of medical invention, from identifying unmet needs to developing clinical and market strategies. The module will help seek to build the participants' awareness of the various roles of surgeons in the design and development of medical devices. This module will support and promote your development as a teacher and assessor in clinical practice. Topics include lesson planning, practicing teaching presentation skills, as well as devising assessment and evaluation strategies. This module aims to support the development of core skills through exploring the concept of professionalism and the principles and practice of advanced communication. Topics include handover, open disclosure of error, and managing challenging communications and difficult interactions in the healthcare setting. This module aims to provide participants with an understanding of the nature of service and the factors that contribute to excellence in leading service in healthcare through lectures, guest speakers, seminars, reading and assignments. These modules aim to enhance a scholar's capacity to assess and manage musculoskeletal conditions that commonly present to GPs and primary care to conduct a clinical assessment and to perform therapeutic procedures, for example, joint injections, with the use of diagnostic imaging where appropriate and available. Scholars can choose to study one or both of these modules. The aim of this module is to introduce surgeons in training to the global healthcare context and specific issues relevant to the surgical profession. Students are expected to gain awareness of surgical needs unique to developing countries and in humanitarian crises. The aim of this module is to develop an understanding of the evolution and guiding principles of lean healthcare and the link between lean, your patients and patient value. 